Then came a man named Sultan Abdul Aziz. He realized something. The state had no funds, no government banks, no factories, no manufacturing. The state was fully dependent on Europe. He wanted to make the state independent. However, he knew it could never happen without cutting off connections with Europe. And so, he planned for the state to operate locally and nationally, without external interference from Europe. His ideas of heading towards production instead of consumption and operating independently made him the unwanted man of Europe. Europe wanted to reduce the power of the Caliph by bringing forth constitutional monarchy. However, the Sultan did not submit to the Western imperialist, and so headlines spread all throughout Europe, accusing him of being a thief, a dictator, a tyrant. His people no longer supported him. He was deposed and sent to Faraya Palace, where he'd be martyred. Since the Sultan was a large, strong man, three wrestlers were appointed to assassinate him, and so, under the disguise of suicide, they cut both of his wrists until he bled to death, though, in the forensic report it was claimed to have been suicide.